London Lightning lead the Windsor Express 2-0 in the National Basketball League of Canada Central Division Final. For anyone who hasn't watched the game, they think of a 2-0 lead as being pretty dominant, pretty extensive. In fact, nothing could be further from the truth. The difference in those two games was three points. And in fact, Windsor might consider themselves unfortunate that they didn't get out of this two games in London with a 2-0 lead. The games have been tough, they've been close, in some cases they've been vicious, and you can expect that only to continue when the Lightning and Express meet on Thursday for Game 3. It's not going to be in Windsor, it's going to be in Bell River, because the Windsor Arena is booked up with a Memorial Cup. So what you're going to get is a smaller arena, lots of people packed together, two teams that dislike each other a great deal. You can only imagine what's going to happen. Now the Lightning have gotten this lead because they've had tremendous performances from their bench and from one of their three-headed monsters, Garrett Williamson. Williamson has responded by leading the NBA. Garrett Williamson has responded by leading the NBL in playoff scoring at 26 points average. In game two, he tipped in a buzzer beater to give the Lightning a one-point win. Williamson is playing as well as he's ever played for the London Lightning. And as a veteran, he is a true leader of this team and a true professional. But the bench has also responded with players like Marvin Phillips, Doug Herring Jr., and several others who have come through, making it very difficult for the Express to cover the big two of Royce White and Ryan Anderson. Game three will be a key game in this series. It's either three nothing, London, or it's going to be 2-1, and the series is going to be wide open, wide open. Sorry. Game three is going to be a key in this series. London's either going to take a stranglehold, or the Windsor Express will be back in the series.